It's been months since COVID-19 vaccines became widely available, and that means researchers are learning more about the impacts and benefits. And a new study found that the breast milk of mothers vaccinated against COVID-19 contains a significant supply of antibodies that may help protect nursing infants from the illness. It's called passive immunity. WRTV's Cornelius Hawker talks to a vaccinated mom who hopes her donated breast milk will help protect babies against COVID-19. This is something that I am extremely proud of being able to do. Mom of two, Erica Clagus, is talking about donating her breast milk. It's something she's done before, but this time she's fully vaccinated against COVID-19. I reached out to my milk bank liaison to see if I would still be able to donate and she highly encouraged it and said absolutely. And so I have since given a, a batch of milk um, with the COVID antibodies through the, the vaccine. Since the pandemic began, researchers and doctors have been studying the impact of getting COVID and the vaccine on those who are pregnant, lactating and their babies. Now, the CDC, along with the American College of Obstetricians and Gynecologists, are recommending getting vaccinated as a way to protect your child through passive immunity. But it's just another kind of compelling reason for moms to breastfeed, to provide that um, initial protection for their babies. Sarah Long, Director of Clinical Operations for the Milk Bank, says they're always in need of donors. Having COVID-19 antibodies in the milk is an added benefit for the babies that receive it. Essentially, most of our milk does end up it to um, in a NICU um, to a fragile infant. Erica hopes sharing her story will put people's minds at ease concerning being vaccinated while breastfeeding and even donating your milk. I would hope that me taking that step uh, to protect my own child would be taken into consideration and that I, I hope that protection travels onto any babies that would get my milk. Cornelius Hawker, WRTV. You can learn more about the Milk Bank, how to donate, and who they help in this story at WRTV.com. And the CDC and medical experts continue to encourage pregnant women to get vaccinated or to talk with their doctor if they're unsure. Fetal medicine experts say there have been no findings that the vaccines can impact fertility, but they can protect babies who can get the COVID antibodies through the umbilical cord. A lot of these safety concerns that people had in terms of risk for miscarriage, birth defects, early delivery with receipt of vaccine have not borne out. As of mid-August, the most recent CDC numbers show about 77% of pregnant women have not been vaccinated against COVID-19.